Greetings everyone, Slurgical here. I am very excited about this video because this video is all about a full 3x3 three three feet game board. It includes limestone uh, terrain, flat cracked landscape, canyons like this one, and trees, alien trees. And they're all compatible with all my terrain sets. So you can use nib nub connectors to connect them, or you can use my framework system which are all of each little uh, six by six uh, inches framework. And they all connect together like that. You see, moves and it's secure. Now enough of me on the video. I will show you the digital files, it's just easier that way. There is a total of 36 tiles in the set. In purple, six uh, canyon sets. In brown, there are 12 uh, sandstone rocks formations. In blue, 10 cracked landscape. In orange, four just uh, plain landscapes that will match and do a transition into other terrain like uh, the outpost or the city or the lab or anything else that I uh, create. Finally, in yellow, there are four tiles that is a transition between the arid cracked landscape and the regular landscape. Since this is a modular terrain, that means when you put the tiles down, you can rotate them and you get from one to the other. So every time you play a game, it can always look like a different landscape because you can uh, lay it out any way that you want to have uh, the best result suited for the current game that you were planning to play. The set also comes with uh, two tree trunk, alien tree trunk, and 20 leaves. So if you zoom into the leaves, you can see there's a little knob that you glue it, the base on for the trunk. And that little bar there is just a stronger support. So the, when the, the glue gun or whatever you're using can doesn't melt it or bend it in an off shape. I encourage you to write the painting recipe underneath the tiles and the number of the tiles so you can keep track. If you notice, these are really smooth in surface and these are jagged with little square frames and stuff like that. So to avoid this, print the tiles standing up. So since the printing looks much better on, uh, on the sides and on the top. And make sure that you put the correct uh, support underneath because the corners will lift. And those tiles were unusable, so the only way to reuse them was to plastic weld them. Unfortunately, I deleted the video where I plastic welded and I'll have to show that in a different video at another time. The best way for the leaves to paint them is just to glue them on a, on a stick or a surface because I initially I painted them on the tree trunk and uh, when it came to paint it was just a nightmare. So make sure that you glue them on a surface that you can trust and that it's easy to paint. In my case I am using a, a lolly, uh, not lollipop, uh, those sticks, whatever they're called. I currently can't think of it. I usually put five on them so it's enough spacing so you just do a whole bunch of them like that and uh, then you can start painting them and finish them while they're on the stick at a later point you just snap them off and you glue them on the trunks of the trees for the trunk part i just use a pill bottles or whatever device that you use i just glop down some uh, glue gun uh, and then uh, glue and you just plopped the trunk on it and there you go I've been priming all that stuff with the Mod Podge. Uh, you prime it with whatever you want. Uh, for Mod Podge, it's just what I had at the time, and using a spray can in winter in Canada is a bit of a pain. And, and I haven't, I still have to set up my uh, my uh, airbrush booth because I changed the office around and it's all dismantled. Time to do the tree trunk now. I'm putting a bunch of uh, much podge on it and it's it's a bit of a pain because it's really thick so once you you apply it everywhere I use another brush to clean up the excess so I take a fresh brush and I just go and poke it in those little uh, excess of uh, much podge and and whatever I miss otherwise will just uh, be applied elsewhere and it all works out at the end and everybody's happy Thank you so much for watching this video and please uh, subscribe and uh, 
press the like button, leave a comment. It really helps with the algorithm, uh, the algorithm and put my uh, content out there. And uh, you can purchase this uh, terrain set at my online store and you can follow that link down in the below the video.